Hello everyone, I'm Michelle and today on Couch Therapy we are going to take a look at the automatic curling irons. Now I know that um, these have been a trend everywhere like on TikTok, YouTube um, and there's been a lot of uh, other companies coming out with um, cheaper ones, different, you know, rebranding, no name brands. I've seen them on Wish. I've seen them on AliExpress. Um, I got mine off of Amazon. I got this. Uh, I get it on sale for. I think it was $19.99. I think right now this one is $32 on Amazon. I do believe. It did come, and I have it charging right now. Um, this is what it looks like. I took it out of the box to um, to uh, charge it up. It did come with a slight charge, but for the purpose of the video, I wanted to make sure that it was charged. It's, I mean, you know, it's pretty nice. Uh, let's see here. The box that it came in has like a flippy thing. It did come with two clips and like a rat tail comb, a velvet carrying bag because it's uh, rechargeable. So I have been letting it charge. I did notice that it charges, pardon me, kind of a short charging cable but it's uh, USB to USB-C. Plugs into the bottom of it. It does have four different settings here on the bottom. So I think I charged it up a little bit. It did come out of the box, like I said, with like two bars. You turn it on and it beeps. It's got two bars. You can see it with the glare. It's telling me it's heating by flashing right there. And I have it set to 300 degrees Fahrenheit. And the time says 12 seconds. I imagine that's what that is telling me. It has the forward and reverse on it. Go that way and that way. So let it heat. It does have, let's say the battery's got two bars on it. So hopefully, hopefully we can test it out with that Why it's heating up. It doesn't feel hot right now. So we will let that heat. Um, put the charger over there. This is, it literally just has a, a number. MDJ 808 cordless hair curler. Curls hair anytime anywhere I do believe and it definitely says in the back made in China I thought it came with instructions somewhere but we're gonna need the clips they're just kind of cheap little alligator clips but it, at least it came with them though. And the rat tail comb. I gotta swear it came with instructions, but maybe it did not. Okay, so I think it's supposed to beep when it's done. Now I have, let's see, it's getting, it's getting more warm down here. I imagine you can change the the settings on it for the different temperatures by pressing the set button. But I just kind of defaultly set it to 300 because my hair is uh, my hair is damaged. It's bleached. I kind of it's all it all I did was wash it, lightly blue dry it with the dif the diffuser, mostly air dried it. So I'm going to take my hair down it's mostly dry I have already slightly wavy hair 
this is just kind of naturally air dried a little bit of a little bit of diffusing in it now normally what I do to, to style my hair is I do just a scrunch method oh wait it beeped and it stopped flashing and went down to one battery so let's see if we can't get a curl out of this and see what it does before it runs out so my hair is very thick and my hair is definitely bleached I don't know if these little clips that come actually with it will hold my hair because my hair is quite thick oh man use two of them I have a lot of hair a lot of hair okay I am I'm kind of doing it in the viewfinder so I thought it had instructions because you were supposed to I guess measure the the amount of hair that you're supposed to put in it I'm gonna see that's about right maybe hope that's not too much um, I guess you do it like this and, and where's the buttons oh, put it like this Okay, it's beeping. And we're waiting, see what it does. Oh wow, look at that. Well, that's a pretty curl. I mean, it's, it's not really hot, it's warm. It's a pretty curl. That was going that was the bottom button in this direction. We can try the, the top one. Let's see. I, the reason why I was really interested in getting this is because I struggle with the traditional curling iron. Um, let's see here. Let's get a curl underneath here. My goodness, I struggle so much with the traditional curling iron. I always have. These clips are quite small. My hair is quite thick. Where's that little piece? Okay. Ouch. So does it tell you? So I guess I'll put this, I'm kind of backwards. I don't know how to, how to do that. I'm gonna do, try the top one. There is kind of like a, where's the camera? There's a kind of like a partition in there, like right here. I don't know if you got to set your hair on one side for one direction or one side for the other direction. I'm not sure, but we'll try the other direction. It's beeping. I don't feel like heat or anything radiating from it. It's really close to my scalp, so. Okay, that one. Not bad, not bad. Can you see it? It has shine to it. I don't have any product in my hair. I just, like I said, I just shampooed it, lightly blue dry it. How pretty. I wonder if, see, I've got like a longer part of fringe right here. Let's see, let's see if I can curl this shorter piece of hair. Because sometimes I like to curl the end part of my fringe. I hope that's not too much. Let's see if this works. This. Beep. Well, that's it. It curled on shorter hair. Kind of curled my fringe that 
longer part inward. Oh, that's not bad. I don't know. I mean, this is a lot of hair. I don't know how long this, this is really going to take me to do. Let's try something up here. Let's see about on the top of the head how it looks. Let's see. Maybe coordination is the key. Um, in like that. Oh, that was a little scary. Kind of grabbed my hair. Like an awkward. You know, for a $20 curling iron, I would say that's not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna do a full head and do a style, and then I'll be back to show you guys. I just wanted to pop back in while I was doing my hair. This strand right here seemed to have gotten tangled when I was doing it. I don't know exactly what I did wrong. I was trying to curl like the ends of my hair. Uh, oop, there's a piece sticking out there that's kind of attached. Let's see. That was better. I don't I don't know exactly what I did. I was doing it the same, but I kind of wanted to show you. This is what I've made progress on. I don't five minutes, not even five minutes. This is the section of my hair here. Um so I will work on this and see how long that it actually takes me to do. Because like I said, I have a lot of hair. And the battery died. I'm gonna have to charge it. Okay, I did plug it in because it ran out of charge when I was trying to finish my hair. But I did just learn I have it plugged in to a USB extender down into my laptop to charge. And it says it's charging right there. It's heating up. So, good thing. You can use it while it's charging which I did not know that because some of the other ones said that you couldn't use it while it was charging. And I just, because the, the charging cord is so short, I had a USB extender, I plugged it in and I have it charging via my laptop right now. So we'll see if we can finish my hair. Okay, I was using it while it was plugged in, 
and then it just died but it says it's still charging okay I'm back um, I've had dinner it's been two and a half hours and it's still charging I don't know I took it out of my laptop I used a wall plug I don't know if it just wasn't strong enough to charge but as you can tell, I have not been able to finish my hair. And it's starting to get kind of late, so I will just show you what curls that I do have. Maybe the curling iron, I don't know. I have it connected to the UX, USB extender. Maybe it just needs to be straight with a wall adapter. I'm not 100% sure on that. Uh, but it's not really, it's like, keeps flashing and going up to the two. I turn it on and let it heat and within like a minute it starts beeping me to tell me the battery's dead. So it just may, I mean, it's kind of warm. Maybe it needs to sit for overnight charging. So we will see, set that there for now. I mean, this is, I can take down my hair I mean, I really did love the curls. Get all these clips out of my hair. I don't, I'm not crazy about these little tiny clips that it comes with, but that's only ouch, because I have thick hair that they get tangled up out in my hair. I normally use a pretty large clips, but overall, you kind of fluff that out some. Overall, I mean, I was, you know, loving the curls. Loving what it was doing for my hair, anyway. I just run my fingers through it. I mean, I've had it up in a clip. This, my hair's literally been sitting in the clips for three hours. And it's, it's held the curl. I really wanted it to work. It worked. I didn't say that it didn't work. I was disappointed that it wasn't holding the charge or not charging quick enough. So my recommendation is to maybe fully charge this overnight or I don't know, plug it in first thing in the morning. I'm hoping, I don't know, when I get done, I'm gonna take this off and put it straight into um straight into the wall and see if that makes it charge any faster but i've literally been sitting and waiting for almost three hours for it to charge i did turn it on a couple of times but the curls are nice let me get my brush i wanted to kind of see if i brushed it out mm -hmm. my hair's a little frizzy and static but it's also very dry in the house i mean it brushes out oh, it's not bad a little scrunch i didn't put any products in my hair so i mean compared to the other side which is yeah no products But I imagine if I had put some products in my hair beforehand, I usually use um, a curling mousse and before I do anything to my hair, but I, I really wanted a first impressions on what it would do to my hair. I mean, I do like the curls. I just wish it would have charged. It just keeps flashing. Like it's charging, I'm gonna let it sit and maybe I'll be able to do a full head and give you guys a complete style. But for right now, it just needs to go back up. <laughs> oh, 
But thank you for watching and I will keep you guys updated on um, what, how, actually how long it kind of took to fully charge. And maybe in my next video, I'll have my hair fully curled with a full style. That way you can kind of see what it would look like like, like that. Hopefully um, my next video I did, um, everybody's probably already heard about it, Miss A. Um, it's a like a online dollar store for makeup. I ordered a few things uh, before there's another order gonna come in and I wanted want to show it all to you guys everything that I got I had ordered um, some eyeliner and which I have on right now which I really really love and it was only I think a dollar fifty five but anyway that'll be my next video will be a Miss A haul and then in the future um, I wanted to do um, maybe some like Aliexpress or Wish some of those the weird out of products that I just never really got a chance to do. But thank you all for watching and I will see you in the next video.